Hello guys, this is Kazim here. Thanks for tuning to this training video. For those of you who don't know me, I'm a graphic designer and today I'll be teaching you how to create a weather app icon in Adobe XD. And uh, before we get started, please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the like button if you like this video and don't forget to hit the bell icon for your notifications so you'll receive a notification whenever I post a trading video online. So without any further ado, let's get started. So once you have opened up uh, your Adobe XD, just uh, open a blank canvas and then on the left side you can see the tools here. So first thing you need to do is grab your rectangle tool, the shortcut is R on the keyboard. And then while holding down shift, click and drag a perfect square like this. Once this is done, just uh, grab your move tool again. It's a control shortcut key is V on the keyboard. And then what you need to do is add a fill of a gradient of a sky. So just remove the borders by unchecking this checkbox on the right side here next to the border. And now the fill, click on the color fill white. And then from the drop down menu from the solid color, click on this drop down arrow and then click on linear gradient. So the now the top color is white and the bottom is gray so to change these two colors just click on this circle white here and then just from the slider choose a lighter shade of blue just choose a lighter shade of blue like this and then the second half just click on the second circle and then again navigate to the same blue section and just make a darker but the or previous one just click on it and make it more lighter and then once this is done you need to round the edges of this rectangle so click on it and you can click on this icon that says different radius from for each corner and you can enter the values here or else you can just grab the V tool the pointer tool and then uh, if you zoom in you can just see this uh, pointers next to the corners the inside ones just click any of these and just click and drag on the right side i'm just clicking and dragging the left pointer point corner and then it will make it rounded edges so you can just click and make it round as per your liking i'll just set it to here as of now once this is done then for the cloud you can just click the rectangle tool again and i'll click and drag without holding down shift this time and I will create a rectangle then again I will click on the pointer tool and make these edges rounded like so and then I will just click uh, while holding down shift I will click and drag one of the edges and make the rectangle larger and then I will click and drag the oval tool the ellipse tool and then I will while holding down shift just click and drag on this and then select your pointer tool and then uncheck the border now we have like a cloud shape icon here i'll just place it here and then i'll shift click both these two i'll grab these two and then command g for grouping these two or else you can also do right click and click on group so once these are grouped just place it them like this here and then again grab the oval tool for making the sun icon I'll just click and drag and make the oval larger in this case. I'll remove the border from this and then I'll click on the fill and I'll choose a yellow I'll choose a yellow portion of the like a oranges like a sun color. Yeah, this is a better. So once you have done that, just click on the selection tool and then click on your cloud and right click on it and bring to front so now this is a cloud section is in front of the sun you can again group click on this group and remove the border as you can see there is a slight border on the first uh, cloud rectangle we had created just uncheck this so now this doesn't have any border just do it again so it will have no borders again then you just click on the cloud and just lower the opacity to around say 80 percent 
85 so now there you go we have a weather icon for the apps in Adobe XD we just created now we can export this as a PNG and use it in our new offer designs thanks guys thanks for watching so how was that video guys I hope you enjoyed uh, getting the uh, weather app icon in Adobe XD so if you have any uh, training video suggestions which you would like me to post for you uh, for, for any specific topics you can just uh, leave your comments below and I will be happy to answer them so again please don't forget to subscribe my youtube video and hit the like button if you like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel and also uh, hit the notification icon to get notified whenever I post videos like this so see you in the next videos guys thanks thanks for watching